Hello and welcome back. So for those of you who'd rather not use MongoDB for whatever reasons, there's a MySQL path for you. So assuming you already have MySQL, let's get started. If you don't have MySQL, then for Windows, just go to this website, right? And download this installer. Make sure you don't download the web community one. Download the installer community and as you can see, it's pretty big. Download it. Go through the installer, make sure, repeat, make sure you install it as a service, all right? Because you want it to run every time you start Windows. For Ubuntu users, this tutorial is going to come with a small script. And this script is only three lines and it should help you get set up with MySQL. So now that you have MySQL installed, you should be able to just type in MySQL, dash you for username then root or whatever username you set when you install mysql then dash t hit enter and of course enter your password this password is going to be the password you use when you set up mysql so now that you have mysql you should have a prompt like this the next thing i want you to do is create a database so just create database database all right and just name it pos okay terminate this hit enter and as you can see now you have a new database all right so we're down in here just exit out of this and now with this tutorial it's going to come with another file and this file is going to be called silver pos backup sql all right so this contains so this is a database that contains about four or five records all right so navigate to this file on your terminal all right or your command prompt if you're on windows so what i'll do is i'll just close this out and open this in a terminal so now that you are in this terminal all right in this path sorry what i need you to do is just type in mysql dash u for your username and your username of course dash p for password and in here remember the database we created called pos all right and the angle which is the less than symbol all right and then the name of this database what we're doing here is basically restoring a database so you're adding this database to your mysql installation all right so this is going to be silver pos underscore backup dot seal oops dot sql all right now hit enter and of course enter in your password here and mysql will restore this database so now let's go back to mysql and enter our password in here all right now we should be able to say show databases and you should have this database called pos now just say use pos let me drag this up all right so just use pos and you should have a database change here now we'll just say select everything from and this has a table called users all right terminate this run this and you should have records like this so as you can see we only have three users here so now that you have mysql all set up with a database get out of this one and the next thing i need you to do is install a bridge between our mysql database and python and this is going to be mysql connector so all you have to do is pip or if you have two versions like me it's going to be pip3 and install we want to install my sql dash connector all right like that run that and this should install my sql connector for you as you can see i already have it okay so now that you have my sql connector installed we are all set up and now we are going to stop here for this one in the next one we are going to start working with MySQL.